I'm uh, Lars Paulson with the LaForge Systems, general manager running our North American operation. We're here at Agritechnica at the booth of the European parent company. We are known in North America for our front hitches. We have had the front hitches marketed in North America for over 30 years. And uh, we are now branching into uh, implement guidance, active implement guidance. We have, uh, for the last two planting seasons in North America, we've had what we call a Dynatrack Classic uh, system that replaces the two-point uh, drawbar on a pull-type planter or a strip till rig. And uh, we are now here at Agritechnica introducing our three-point version of the same concept. And that's what you see here, a uh, Dynatrack premium system that uh, will handle both pull type and three point mounted equipment up to tractors about 200 horsepower. And further back here, we have the uh, Dynatrack Ultima, which is also PTO compatible and uh, will uh, handle tractors up to 400 horsepower. In Europe, they tend to use more three point mounted implements than we do in North America. That's why this is important on this show here in, in Europe to, for us to introduce the three-point version of the very successful uh, Dynatrack system. And uh, we think in North America there is some areas where uh, three-point mounted planters are work both in corn and soybeans, but uh, also in things like peanuts uh, in, in Southeast uh, United States and of course specialty crops all over the West that are run with uh, three-point mounted implement. Uh, there is a market in organic farming where, they, where you cultivate. And the beauty of, of our guidance system is that instead of like some cultivators do, put the guidance in the implement itself, we make a smart quick coupler. So you use a, a quick coupler that has the guidance ca uh, compatibility in the, in the quick coupler itself. And these systems here are plug and play with uh, John Deere's implement guidance system and uh, with the Trimble. The three-point three uh, uh, guidance systems will of course also work with the pull type and two-point mounted. So it, they become really universal as opposed to what we've had now, the classic system where you needed adapters to uh, run anything else than uh, a two-point planter. One thing that we do with the three points is that we stay with Harry Ferguson's original idea of how a three point is supposed to work, where when the implement is in the ground, you have sway, you have converging draft links that um, has an Im uh, imaginary draft point underneath the belly of the tractor. We don't mess with that. We move the whole three point sideways so it still works with sway and it doesn't, um, it doesn't affect the operation of the tractor. If you use other types of guidance systems where you kind of push the implement sideways, you have a tendency to get the opposite reaction on the tractor. So if you want to push the implement up, uh, uphill, it will pull the tractor downhill. If you go on a side hill with a tractor, it has a tendency to crab. And if you shove the implement upwards, the implement will actually point downwards and will have a tendency to want to go down. The way we do it, we, we point all the shanks and the, and the coulters in the direction that you want to move the implement when you guide it. That way you don't fight the loss of nature and, and gravity and you get the more accurate, more smooth guidance and more true to the AB line that you create with the truck. We will have a limited run for the 2018 planting season and um, we will have some three-point versions available. The two-point is already for sale in North America. If you're looking for three points, it's time to uh, go and talk to your dealer right now. They are available through uh, the 2,500 dealers that are already signed up with LaForge in North America.